Clippers looking for a win to lock up home court advantage. In their first round series against the Memphis Grizzlies, a very emotional night, as it could be the final night the Kings call Sacramento home. It all got started on October 25th, 1985. The Sacramento era of Kings basketball features some greats, including Mitch Richmond. They lost that debut against the Clippers here to Marcus Cousins, bringing the thunder in the first quarter. Lamar Odom for the Clippers misses. Odom tips in his own miss. It was 31-27 in the second. Chris Paul, he takes it to the cup. Nice handle, the scoop to the hoop for the deuce, plus the foul. He would miss the free throw. Clippers leading 44-37. Chris Paul doing it again, this time the fadeaway. He had 25 points and 11 assists. On to the second half of action we go. Kings playing for pride. Marcus Thornton from downtown makes it a six-point game. Fans all fired up. Isaiah Thomas to Thornton. He had 21, including this triple to put Sacramento up by one. Now good ball movement by the Clippers. Karan Butler coming off the 22-point performance Tuesday. He has the Clippers up one. Now Jamal Crawford. He's done a whole lot of that, making his bid to be the sixth man of the year. DeMarcus Cousins, the jumper. He was far from done. Cousins later in the fourth. The driving layup. Look at the big fella. Season high, 36 points. Cousins also pulled down a career best 22 rebounds. Travis Outlaw to Patrick Beverly. Sacramento puts up 38 points in the fourth quarter. Crawford. He's now the Clippers' all-time leader in three-pointers made in a single season, passing Rasheel Butler. Crawford had 24 points and six assists, and then Chris Paul drives and dishes, Blake Griffin making the highlight. Clippers secure home court advantage. A very difficult spot for the fans in Sacramento, not knowing if their team will stay or move out to Seattle. Meanwhile, the Clippers heading to the postseason, riding a seven-game win streak.